This lesson is going to show you how to create your folders in each of your students' uh, Google Drives and also within yours. So we're starting out that you should be on your drive. And the first thing you need to do is click on the red Create and then click on Spreadsheet. So you're going to have your spreadsheet up and what you're going to need to do here is we want to get to a template so that we can uh, get to the G class. So we click on File, and then you're going to click on New, and then From Template. So there are a couple of things that you're going to need to do on this next page. The first thing is you're going to click on Public Templates. This will bring you to the public gallery for all the templates that you could possibly find. Next, we're in the space for the search. We are going to type in uh, G Class Folders and a dash from edison.com. You can see I've been there before, so it came up. And then we're just going to click on Search Templates. So once it goes through, it'll find that, and we're going to click on Use This Template. So far, so good. Now comes the time that we're going to add our information from those files that we've already created with all our student names. So what you need to do is up at the top, find the tab that has your original file. So mine would be for technology. So I'm going to click on that. And I'm going to click in the upper left corner of that page. And then I want to right click to copy all of that information. Now I go back to that copy of my G Class Folders tab. And again, I'm going to click in that corner, right click, and then paste. So it's going to paste all the content from that one file into my G Class folder. Now this is a great time to rename this file. So all you need to do is click on it and rename it. So it gives us a pop-up pop -up, and I'm going to say G Class Technology Setup, whatever you'd like to name it and click OK. We're ready to get started and create our folders. So the first thing, you can now see that an extension has been added onto this worksheet, G Class Folders. So you're going to click on that extension, click on Create Headings, and you'll see at the top your headings are going to change to what they need to be. You can see that I haven't run this script before, so I'm going to get this pop-up. I just say OK, and I'm going to say Accept. So now it's going to run that I'm going to click it one more time to run that script, and it's finished it. And you can see my headings have changed. I'm going to click one more time on that G Class folders. I'm not going to click on Sort Sheet. That will create some changes in the file, so I don't want to click on that. However, I click on Create Folders and Shares. So once I click on that, it will give a little running, and it will create all those folders for me within my student drive drives and my own drive. So this is a quick tutorial on how to create G-Class folders.